Hello folks, it's Edward Freddy the Freak here again. Oh, I thought you missed me. I bet you didn't. I bet you thought I'd gone back to my coffin to have a nice bit of sleep. But I haven't. I watched a thing today called a video last day. Ask your, your parents. They remember them. They were like really bad films. B films with lots of gore and lots of horror. We were banned for a little while. So here's a little tell. Video nasty is a short creepy to tell about a woman who has a strange visitor turned up on her doorstep one dark and lonely night. One evening a young woman named Betty was home alone when she heard a knock on the front door. She opened it and found a young man standing there on the doorstep. He told her that his car had broken down and asked if he could come in and make a call because his cell phone battery had run out. Betty was a funny young woman and which she readily agreed to help him. After he made, after he made his phone call, he offered her a, a, a drink. They sat down in the lounge and began to discuss anything and everything. Their conversation continued long into the night. As it was pretty late, Betty yawned and told the young man that it was probably time for him to go home. However, he in order and continued to talk about a passion for movies. He listed all the movies he'd been seeing recently and asked her opinion about them. He continued to talk and brought up the subject of video nasties, but he didn't know about what the term meant. She explained that a video nasty was a film at which a person was actually murdered. No special effects, no camera tricks, everything was real. But he began to get a little creeped out and explained that she was not, she'd been terrified when she watched one movie, or a movie in particular. It was a morbid story of a young woman who had been trapped by three psychopaths who left the camera running as they killed her and chopped her up. The man began to talk more and more about the video, video narcissists and the long, longer he spoke, the more uneasy she became. While he was talking, Betty's attention was suddenly drawn to a particular red glow under the jacket, the, under the jacket of the guest. Her face grew pale when she realised it was a mistake of a red light for camera that was recording. There you are. Don't go and buy a video nasty. You never know what's going to happen to you kids. Bye bye everybody. Bye bye.